All right, so this is a review for Zero Hour, the current mission. Uh, we'll see what this game brings, and we'll see how I like it. I'll see if I recommend it after the end of the level. Uh, and that will be basically what we're doing here. This says, load marines into bunkers to provide them with extra protection. Marines can still attack enemies from inside a, a bunker. Uh. Good to know. This game's about 30 bucks. Maybe a little bit less now. If you got the Blizzard uh, account. So it's good for that. I'm just playing with uh, sunbeams here with my mouse. And uh, you can see that I'm rotating. Base is under attack. Uh, this is where I was at. Uh, completely chaotic area. Base under, attack under attack by a lot of zergs or something. And uh, basically I'll show you what I can do if I'm able to heal myself. I'm not sure what happens in this, but uh, we'll see how it goes. And... Uh, this game's a lot more quick-paced and like in intense than some of the other games that I play, but it's more strategic and I like it for that. Uh, you gotta heal bases and do this kind of stuff and get people back to work, so that's pretty much how it goes. Let's just watch what happens for a little bit. You can watch on, on either screen, apparently. Uh, it's harder to zoom in on the smaller PC laptop screen, but... And the quality on the bigger screen is not the best, but uh, I got to do audio quality somehow with my voiceover, so. It looks like I'm just healing and trying to make mineral mining at the same time, so that's kind of what I'm doing. Insufficient vesping gas. I have a lot of guys attacking those zergs, though. So it looks like I might be okay. It looks like evacuation is in 3 minutes and 26 seconds. Going ahead and making some tur missile turrets in case any uh, flying creatures come by. This is early level stuff. I'm a lot farther along in the game now, but... Uh, I'm still on the uh, Terran's quest line, so I haven't made it to the Zergs or the Protoss yet, or any of the other guys. Base is under attack. So it's a very long-winded game. If you pay thirty dollars, you'll be playing for a very long time. And it's good quality artwork. You get to have conversations when you're on deck with your main battle cruiser as the Terrans. You can upgrade stuff in your labs. You can do side quests to get Protoss and Zerg uh, equipment as the Terrans to upgrade your equipment to better battle street and stuff like that. You can build bunkers and all sorts of armories and uh, barracks and you know, Base depots and all this kind of stuff and train different guys and get mercs, mercs and mercenaries and battle cruisers and all this kind of stuff. So it's a really cool game. I like it a lot, actually. So that's, that's about my review into about three minutes of me watching myself play this game again. It's a good game. I recommend it to people. It's like games that I used to play on my PC when I had my first PCs back in the day. So I still really like these kind of games a lot. Not enough minerals. Base is under attack. We can use some help here. The doctor is in. So it looks like I really want to thank uh, Blizzard for making these games. Because I really like them and uh, I'm totally into them.
Gonna build another bunker right there. Uh-oh, they're swarming. I don't know if I'll survive this, actually. They're, like, super swarming. This is why this game gets intense, dude. I don't have enough medics. I'm glad I stayed for this part, because it gets real, dude. Alien invasion! Get them, humans! I said interdimensional, not extra... Terrestrial. Base is under attack. You want a piece of me, boy? No! I swarm in and blow the shit out of them right in time, dude. Look at that. Battle cruisers, dude. Serious warfare. Right in time. Hell yeah! Welcome to the party. Good game, dude. Right in time. Achievements awarded 15. Achievements awarded 10. Enemy units killed 4, 18, or 16. Total units owned 96. Units lost 94. Structures salvaged or lost 12. Hatcheries destroyed 0 of 2. Rebel squads rescued 3 of 3. 0 hour. 20 minutes and 8 seconds total. Good artwork. That's what I'm talking about with this game. A lot better looking on the laptop on this camera phone, like, recording it, but... You know, because the light quality on my... Uh... TV is a little bit weird. Anyways, I think there's a little bit more of this, and it's got a video segment, so we'll let it play out. Damn, Jimmy. You've been holding out on me. Cut it pretty close there, Matt. Never left you hanging before, sir. Fair enough. Just good voice acting. Good uh, game design, good texturing. Interesting sci-fi elements. Brace for warp jump on my mark. Nice. What the hell happened? We ain't seen the Zerg in years. Why attack Marsara now? It's not just Marsara. You need to see this. Devastation spread throughout all outer ring plots. Sustained heavy losses. Casualties in the billions. Minutes ago, the Zerg attacked a Dominion military research facility. It's interesting. I like this game a lot. We always knew she'd be back. But what's she after? Bum bum ba dum ba dum bum ba dum ba dum bum ba dum 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 There's no telling what the Zerg will throw against us this time. Sir, we need to make sure our hardware and munitions are up to the challenge. Yeah, I'll check in with Swan down the armory. Knowing him, he's already got upgrades for us. I hate to ask, sir, but is there a reason that convict's still on my bridge? Easy, Matt. Tychus is one of my oldest friends. He helped me out of a real bind a few years back. I owe him. Swifty. Well, your friend has a criminal record as long as mine. Believe me, if Tychus Finley wanted me dead, 
I could dead already. Understood, Time can sir. spend Liana game for like 30 euros. 30 Deutschmarks or 18 Grubels. Just how bad is it, Matt? Zerg are attacking all over the sector, sir. Manx pulled the fleet back to protect the Dominion core worlds, leaving the fringe worlds to fend for themselves. It's a nightmare. There's no way we can stop an alien invasion with one capital ship and a handful of volunteers. Another if five minutes and 38 seconds. We can earn ourselves a fortune working for Mobius while this whole thing blows over. You don't get it, convict. This isn't gonna just blow over. The Zerg won't stop until we're all dead. Oh, we gotta don't get worry, him, man. We I forgot. Out. We're in the but middle of exactly something here. I had the pee either. break. We'll earn some cash and build up our forces so we can make a difference when it counts. I'll hold it in for a minute. What am I doing? Talking to Tychus? Still? What do you want, dude? One hell of a ship you got here, Jimmy. Oh, duh. How'd you get a hold of a floating palace like this? Being amazing. The Hyperion was Meng's flagship back in the day. Me and Matt uh, decided to borrow her when we parted company with him. Uh, so baby seen us through some tight that spots. That was that chick in the background. Speaking the of tight spots, perfect. Tychus, why are you still wearing that suit on my bridge? Yeah, Somebody farted. Did you bust the she zipper sang. or something? Ew, okay. Tychus. Gross. So I might have had a little help when I broke out of prison. Let's just say Whatever, you came at a price. I get to stay locked up in this suit till I pay off all my debts. I know, you gotta lock your farts up. That's what she's saying debts. with her Game Boy. She's like, God, this guy smells up. gross. They're Mobius boys, Can't even shower. Had him just run into him in a museum, you know. They want them artifacts something fierce. Debt, well, I need those, so if you can fart in your suit, for your then you can can it. Part of the deal. Booyah! Achievements awarded, 10. Nice hair, stupid. Let's do some serious hey, grumble time. Our glorious leader has returned! <laughs> hey, man, what's up, cowboy? What do you got for me, Swan? Well, the usual, building up our standard forces. Bringing my troops and hardware up to speed, huh? Yep, you can add upgrades for their tech right here on the console. But building an army on the run ain't cheap. You brought back credits this time, right? Look, I know money's been tied. But that artifact we just picked up from Marsar is gonna solve everything. Yeah, I've heard that. See, it's basically one. describing what it's I already described time. to you about the gameplay yeah, and the me mechanics, mechanics and stuff. So here's the mechanic. His name is Swan. He's in the armory stuff. Upgrading what we got is all well and good. But when are we getting new hardware? A lot of gaps in our inventory right now. As Sometimes I said, this was early job, game stuff, so this is good for review. It's not showing, like, so spoiler more alerts more. or anything. The plans for other stuff, we gotta either beg, borrow, or steal. Don't listen to this if you don't want to hear what he's saying. And it's harder to hear what he's saying because I'm talking over him. But as you can see, there's nothing in the armory just yet, but I've got, like, battle tanks and battle cruisers and all this crazy shit now. So I spoiled it with a star map. In an armory console in the armory at the Hyperion. So, anyways, that's what this battle cruiser does. Welcome to the game. It's fantastically awesome. Armory console. Let's do it, people. Upgrade the marine or the medic. Those are your options. Combat shield or stim packs. There's still stim packs, Bethesda. Good idea. Advanced medic facilities. Yes. Am I going to do it for 6,000? 6, 60,000. Left with 40,000 credits available. Let's close it down, people. That was good work. Anything for the base? Projectile accelerator. Purchase for 40,000 for the bunker. Am I going to do it? Yes. Easy first level game shit. Way to go. Blizzard. Shout out to Bethesda boys. Public Enemy Who? Cinematic. The Deal? Old Times. Escape from Marsara. Three of 25 missions completed with the game. At this point when I was making it like months ago. Now it's probably like something else. I don't remember. Escape from Marsara, obviously. Anyways, that was my review. It's a good game. Peace. Take care. We got another minute 12. Let's just let it slide out.
say a man never really knows himself. Until his freedom's been taken away. I wonder... That was it. Step into the shoes of a warrior to do battle in space against Zergs and Protoss as the Terrans or vice versa. Sweet game. Thanks, Blizzard. Peace.